Good evening. Good evening, Tisha. How are you, Anna? I'm fine, Tisha. Excellent. How was your day? Yeah, way the class. Okay. Um, it's uh, exciting. Uh, exciting. All right, that's nice. And were you able to enter to the platform, Anna? Yes, I did. You did. All right. Did you work on any exercises? Yes. You did. Okay, very good. Good evening, Jose Angel. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Okay, teacher. And you? All right, I'm fine, thanks. How was your day? Good, very good. Okay, that's nice. Did you work? Yes. What yeah, do you do? Sorry? What do you do? A que se dedica? What do you do? Ah. Ah, motociclista. Oh, okay. That's nice. And were you able Thanks. to enter to the platform? Yes, yes. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Yes. All right, that's nice. Good evening, Maria del Rosario. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? I'm doing pretty well. And you? Uh, very well. Excellent. How was your day? You. Excellent. All right. Great. Yes. Were you able to start working in the platform today? Yes, I finished the section one. Oh, you're done with section one. That's nice. Yes. Yes. How was it? Was it easy, difficult, so so? Uh, easy. It's it's easy. easy. All right. Yeah, it's a review, yeah. right? Okay. Yes. Yeah. Very good. Thank good you. evening, Carlos Herrera. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, and you? Fine too, teacher. All right, that's nice. How was your day? It's good, teacher. It's good. Okay. And you? Um, it was nice. Was it? Just a little busy, <clears throat> but it was good. All right. Excellent, teacher. Yes, thanks for asking. So were you able to access to the platform and start working? Um, not yet, teacher. Not yet. Sorry. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. So please, I ask you to um, do it as, as soon as you can, please. It's important. Hey, okay. Emma Orozco, how are you? Hello. Hello, how are you? Fine, thank you. Great. How was your day, Emma? It was busy, really busy. Oh, it was busy. Okay, you had a lot of work. Or do you study? Yes. No, at work. You work. Okay. Yes. What do you do? I am an assistant. Okay. All right, that's nice. Were you able to work in a platform? Oh, not yet. Not yet. Okay. 
Good evening, Melvin Benitez. Good evening, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, you? I'm well, thank you. How was your day? So tired. It was tiring. You had to work. Yes. Okay. What do you do? Say, como se dice? Sorry, can you repeat that? I couldn't hear you. Algo en comunicaciones, pero no oh, sé cómo se dice. In communication, just... okay. That's interesting. Were you Thank able you. to access the platform? Repeat, please. Yes, were you able to access to the platform? No. <laughs> you were not. Okay, so please do your best to do it as soon as you can. Okay. All right. Good evening, Fabricio Alexander. Fabricio? Hello, hello. How are you? Hello, hello. Hi, can you hear me now? Yes, teacher. Okay. How's it going? How are you? I find teacher. Thanks. All right, that's nice. How was your day? It's a uh, <laughs> It's a uh, <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't hear you. Mm, sorry, I cannot hear you well. No le puedo escuchar muy bien. No sé si seré yo la del problema de conexión o algo, pero... Um, yeah. Okay, so... Now it's time to start with our class. Let's do it. So welcome everybody to our second class of the intermediate level, right? Let's, let me just check the chat. Oh, that's okay, Fabricio, don't worry. Don't worry, it's fine. Okay, so let's start by talking about what makes a great day. So tell me, uh, well, first of all, think about the things that make your day great. What are some good things that may happen to you for having a good day or a great day? For example, for me, one of the things would be to have a free day, right? Not having to work. So what else, Javier, Javier, Javier. what else would make it great? Mm -hmm. Tell me. Mm -hmm. Any ideas? Watch TV. Watching TV, okay. Any other thing? What is it? Listen to music. Listen to music. Okay, anything else? Visit the beach. Okay. Visiting or going to the beach. Also in the chat, Emma says a uh, sunny day, having a sunny day, that's nice. Okay, 
Any other thing that makes a great day? Eat dinner with my family. Eating dinner with my family. Yes, that's very nice. Drink coffee. Drinking coffee. Okay. Any other thing? Sleeping all day. Sleeping all day. Yes, that's perfect, right? Any other thing? Playing to soccer. Make, playing soccer. To make exercise. Do exercise. Okay. So we say doing Eat, eating the lunch. Eating lunch. Okay. Mm. Pretty good. So now that we have um, here a list of the different things that make a great day, let's think about the opposite. What makes a bad day? So what do you say? Um, well, one of the things that would make a bad day for me would be spilling my coffee. What um, else? A headache. <laughs> Having a headache, exactly. Okay, what else? Raining today. Oh, having a rainy day. Yep. Okay. Any other options? How do you say persona de mal humor? Okay, so finding people oops, in bad humor. Any other thing that makes a bad day? How do you say me dejo el bus? Oh, missing the bus. That's pretty bad. <laughs> Not internet. Mm, can you repeat that? No internet. Not having internet. Okay. When the internet is not working. Yeah, that's a chaos. Okay, what else? Having a problem in the work. Having problems at work. Yep. Okay. Tell me another thing that makes a bad day. Uh, rainy day. What is it? Rainy day. A In rainy day. Yeah. Rainy we day. already have it here. Having a rainy day. Okay. Good. Working hard. Working hard. Okay. I think we can. Just leave it until there. So now this is what we are going to do. I am going to send you to the breakout rooms and I'm sending you a picture of the lists that we just made. And we are going to take turns to share experiences, ask and answer questions and by using the, the activities or the, the actions that we have over here. For example, um, you could ask your classmates, did you have a free day today? Did you watch TV? Did you listen to music? And the same goes for the bad day things. Did you spill your coffee? Did you have a headache? And so on. So you are going to listen about their answers and you are going to decide if it had a good day or a bad one, okay? Is that clear? Yes, teacher. Okay, so let me just send you to the breakout rooms and then I'm sending you the picture to the WhatsApp chat. All right, there you go.
um, about a great day today. Hacer oraciones con las. Sí. Ok. Con cualquiera de las dos o con las dos. Acá en el grupo. Eh, no, de la, de los días buenos o los días malos. Sí. Cualquiera de las tres. Como uno quiera, la cuestión es que. Eh, tenemos que conversar. Ahí está. My, my uh, great day for me will be um, I get up so late. I in the house, I visit to my family, I sleep for two hours or three during the day. That's that will be for me a great day. Teacher. Yes. I don't understand the activity. Oh, oh okay. exercise. Uh -huh. All right. So you have to ask and answer questions in the past. For example, um, well, the first thing to make a good date we said was um have a free day. So you can ask your classmates, for example, Anna, did you have a free day today? Not I had to work. Okay, you had work. Then I continue asking you, did you watch TV? Okay. All right, that's what you have to do. You have to make questions. Did you watch TV? Did you listen to music? Did you spill your coffee? Did you have a headache? And so on. Oh, okay. Okay, teacher. Okay. Doris, do you have do you watch TV? Yes, I did, Brenda. Solamente que como las estamos haciendo en pasado, no tendría que ser do you, sino did you. Okay. Así le comprendía a la teacher. Exactly. Okay, did you watch TV? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. Mm -hmm. And uh, the Did you listen music? Yes, I did. Uh, Carlos, did you visit to the beach? No, I didn't. Did you have a sunny day, Marlon? Yes, I did. Did you eat in dinner with your family, Marlo? Yes, I did. <clears throat> Le pregunto yo, did you drink coffee? No, I didn't. Teacher, sí sería, ¿verdad? Yes. Diríamos que no, nosotros armar con el auxiliar did eh, la pregunta y se va a responder en forma corta. Yes, that is right. Ok, teacher, thank you. Ok. 
Did you sleep all day, Marla? No, I didn't. Next, please. Okay. Did you play soccer? Hello, how are you doing? Hello, teacher. Hello. Only, only that teacher. Did you finish? Yes. Yes. You're done with all the questions and everything. In other. Sorry. In other question. Oh. No, I meant, uh, are you done with all the questions? Yes. You are, okay. Very good, so we're getting back in a couple minutes. Okay. 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 What may I say, Ruth? Um, uh, I, I working hard. Uh, is, is busy. My day. What may I say, Jay Miguel? I watching TV and li listen to music and drink coffee. Finding people in bar humor. Uh -huh. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> so, terrible. Oh. Uh, Yes, uh, you what makes a great day? Um, for me, um, having a sunny day, um, a diner with my family, um, do exercise. And um, drink coffee. In the afternoon. Okay, so you had some time to talk about um, your day, right? Was it good or bad? Maria de Rosario, how was your day? Was it good or bad at the end of the day? Maria de Rosario, check your microphone, please. Okay. In my case, uh, a, bad, a bad day. You had a bad day? Really? Maybe. Oh no, what happened? Having a headache and working hard. Oh, that's pretty bad. I hope tomorrow is better. <laughs> <laughs> Catherine Rodriguez, yes. tell me about your day. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Catherine Rodriguez, are you there? Yes. Tell me about your day. Bad because I live in around 
El Salvador University. And how do you say hubo? There was. Protest? Oh, really? Yes, and I driving in heavy traffic. Oh no, that's pretty bad. Yes. Okay. Ana Palma, tell me about your day. My day was uh, very stressful. Really? It, yes, I, I had the lunch uh, about 2 p.m. Very late. Yes. Oh, no. <laughs> Melvin Benitez, tell me about your day. Sorry, Melvin, check your microphone, please. Thanks. Okay, today I, I have um, okay, today I have a, a good day. You had a good day, okay. That's very well. So what happened? Tell me about some things that made it a, a good one. No entendí. Oh, and why was it a good day? Uh, because my work easy. <laughs> oh, it was easy. My work was easy. All right, mm -hmm. that's nice. Very good. Okay. So now let's move on. Yesterday we started reviewing the past, right? So we talked a little bit about was and where, and we also reviewed some of the verbs in the regular, some of the regular verbs in the simple past, right? So remember that we have those verbs that end in ed. And um, well, in order to pronounce them, we have three different kinds of ending sounds that I believe you have already heard about. So the first one would be d, as in enjoyed or planned. Enjoyed, planned. Repeat, please. Enjoyed. 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 Planned. 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 Okay, it's very important to pronounce the last sound because that is the difference between the simple present and the simple past, right? So please repeat. D. 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 Enjoyed. 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 Planned. 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 Plan. Okay, Plan. the next sound we have is t. t. Repeat me. Okay, and we find it in verbs like finished. 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 Fixed. Fixed. Okay, and then we have a third one which is a bit easier. That one is it. Repeat, please. It, 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 it. As in started. 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 And painted. It, painted. 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 Okay, so just remember about that. The verbs, the regular verbs in the simple present and in either d, t, or it, right? Then here I have some practice for you. I want you to get some paper and a pencil or pen, please. So just get something to write. Pencil. Yes, pen or pencil and some paper, maybe a notebook or just whatever. So a piece of paper, whatever. And I want you to copy the sounds, the three sounds, d, t, and it. Okay, this is what we are going to do. I am going to pronounce some verbs for you. And what you have to do is to classify them according to their ending sound. 
For example, okay. the first one is listened. Listened. Where does it go? In d or it? We got d. listened. D. That's right. D. We put it over here, right? Listened. Listened. Okay, so that's what you have to do. You have to listen and you have to place the verb in the corresponding sound. Okay, so let's continue. The next verb is booked. 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 Write it down, please. Okay, very good. Next one. Planted, planted. Yes, I want you to listen and write down, okay? You classify the verbs. So we got listened, booked, and planted. Next one is remembered, remembered. Remembered. Okay, so now I just need I just need you to classify the verbs and we're going to check um at the end, okay? Is that fine? Okay. okay. All right. Cheers. So we got remembered. Our next one is moved. 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 Then we have walked, walked, walked. Next one is looked, looked. Then we got trained, trained. Our next one is wanted, wanted. Then we have played, played. Next is helped, helped. And we also got developed, developed. Next verb is started, started. And the last one is rained rained okay now it's time to check so we got listened over here then we also got remembered moved trained and played and also rained those are the ones we got in the sound so please repeat. Listened. 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 Remembered. 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 Moved. Remembered. Moved. 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 Trained. Trained. Played. 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 Rained. 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 Okay, then we have the verbs that go with at the end. For example, booked, 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 walked, walked, looked, looked, helped, developed, and developed. Okay, please repeat. Booked. 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 Walked. 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 Looked. 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 Helped. 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 Developed. 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 Okay, and in the last space for the sound it, we got planted. Wanted and started. Please repeat. Planted. Planted. Wanted. 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 Wanted.
and start it. Uh huh. Start. Start. start it. Okay. Do we have but, any questions sí, about well, any the words? Um, please turn up your microphone. Porque ocupa el 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 cómo se llama el micrófono de la. Okay. All right. Do we have any questions about any of the verbs? Do we understand the meanings of them? Any questions, any doubts? No. No teacher. No teacher. All right, pretty no. good. So now let's talk a little bit about the simple past for the irregular verbs. So as you may know, um, the, the, the irregular verbs change, right? So there is no rule to follow. We just uh, memorize them. We must learn them by heart because uh, we never know, right? how they change. Some of them are similar or they keep, they remain the same in the, in the present and in the past, but some others change. So we have, for example, do that becomes did, get up becomes get up, go becomes went, meet, met, come, came, and have had. So please repeat. Do did. Do, do did. Get up, got up. Get up, got up. Go, up. go went. Go, go went. 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 Meet, met. Meet, met. 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 Come, came. Come, Come came. came. Have had. Okay. okay, so here I also have a list of verbs for you to practice. I want you to open the chat, please, everybody. You open the chat and we're going to practice the verb. We're going to change them from the present to the past. So we got the first one is begin, it becomes um what's the past of begin any ideas began. Began, began. right begin began okay what's the past of break um Broke. Hello? Great, Broke. please can you type it in the chat broke very good doris the past of build. Can somebody write it in the chat, please? Oh, I believe I got the answers here. Yes, very good, Fabricio. That is built and also Doris who sent it. Okay, the past of buy. What is it? But very good, Mariana Rosario. Catch. What is the past? Catch. It's irregular, so it changes. Okay. What would be the past of catch? Anybody? Cut. That is right, Carlos. Oh. We got cut. Okay, next one is choose. Choose. Jason. What's the past? It's chose. That's right, Fabricio. Chose. Then we have cut. What's the past? Cut. cut. Yes. Cut. It remains the same, right? Draw. What would be the past form? Drew. Drew with E. Drew. 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 Next one is drink. What's the past? Drunk. Drunk. Drunk right? Drunk. Very good, Emma. And the past of drive is? Throw. 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 Tell me about the past of fall. Fail. Fail. That is fail. 
Okay, then we have feel. What's the past form? Exactly. Feel. Felt. Feel. Very good, Doris. Felt. The past of fine is? Found. 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 That is right. The past of forget. Yes. Forgot. 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 Forgotten. Forget. Yes. The past of give? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Gabe, now tell me about the past of here. Here. Yeah. Here. 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 Okay, the past of no. New. 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 The past of lose. Lost. 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 The past of pay, paid. paid. The past of read is read. 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 read, read. Remember, it's the same, but we pronounce it in different ways. Yes. In the first yeah, sentence, it's no read. Problem. In the past, is read. Next one is read. ride. Road. What's the past? Road. Road. Okay, then we have run. 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 Okay, Run. next one is say. 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 Okay, then we have see. See. Oh. Oh. So, so, very good, Doris. So. The past of sing is. Sam. Sang. The past of speak? Spoke. 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 The past of swim is? Swam. 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 The past of tell? Told. Told. Tell me the form of think? Thought. 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 Okay, now tell me about the verb write. Wrote. 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 And understand becomes? Understood. 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 That is right. Okay, now please repeat after me. Begun. 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 Broke. 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 Built. But cut chose chose cut cut drew 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 drank drove drove Fell. Felt. 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 Found. 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 Forgot. 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 Gave. 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 Heard. 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 New. 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 Lost. 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 Paid. Hey, red, 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 road, road, road. road. Run. Run. run, 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 head, so, head. so, 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 Oh. Swam. Swam. Told. Told. Thought. 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 Growth. Growth. Right. Understood. There's two. Okay, very well. So now let's talk a little bit about the simple past in the negative form. So we have, first of all, the past of be, which is 
What is it? I wasn't, wasn't password. Password. Exactly. We got wasn't was. or was not. Weren't. And weren't or were not. Okay. Tell me an example using wasn't or weren't. Anybody? Make a sentence using wasn't or weren't. I wasn't watching. I wasn't watching. TV? A movie or TV, okay. Wasn't oh, is bad. Yep, I got it. Okay, tell me another example, please. And just remember, um, this sentence, this kind of sentence, is not the simple past, right? That is the past progressive, but still, we use wasn't, so it's fine. I wasn't studying. Okay, English. try to make one that doesn't take another verb. Only wasn't or weren't. For example, um, they weren't home. Ah. Okay, because I was telling you about this. So using an ing verb after wasn't or weren't is okay. However, we're talking about a different tense. It is not a simple past. It's a past progressive or past continuous. So that's the thing. Okay, let's make another example using she. What can we say? She was not. She was. In the English class? In the English class. Excellent. Okay, maybe we got another example in the chat. Let me check. She was not at the meeting. Yes, very good. Okay, so that's how we use was and where in the past. Now tell me what happens with the other verbs. What do we do in those cases? Mm -hmm. So what is the auxiliary speak, use? Spoke. That is in the affirmative, but yes. what happens in the negative? And speak and spoke, teacher. Yes, that is correct for the affirmative sentences, right? For the affirmative okay. form of the verbs. But what happens to the negative? So if I have a sentence, for example, using spoke, I spoke with my parents yesterday. I spoke with my parents yesterday. Make it negative, please. I did speak. I didn't speak I with my parents yeah. yesterday, right? So that means that we need to use the auxiliary did not, did not or didn't. And something important to keep in mind is that we add the verb, but in the base form. So in this case, we say, I didn't speak. We do not say, I didn't spoke, right? I didn't speak. Okay, tell me some other examples using didn't or did not. Anybody? I didn't go work I, last night. I didn't work last night. 
Okay, any other example? Let's use the subject he. He did not. He, he did not di dinner. Eat dinner. Eat or dinner. Have dinner. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Let's make another one using we. We didn't. Oops. We didn't. We didn't the beach last weekend. We didn't. Sorry, can you repeat it? We didn't. We didn't go the beach last weekend. Okay. All right. So there you have it. Just remember about that. And whenever we're talking about the verb be in the past, in the negative form, we use wasn't or weren't or was not and were not. And for the other verbs, we have the auxiliary did not or didn't. And it's important to remember that with those, uh, well, with this kind of auxiliary, we use the verb in the base form, right? So here we say, I didn't work. And we do not say, I didn't work, right? I didn't work. I did not eat. We didn't go. Okay, so let's continue with some practice. So here I have some sentences that we must put in the right order. Let me see, um, help me with number one, Carlos Herrera. I didn't have breakfast. Very good. Next one, Doris Aime. Susan did not uh, buy bread at the bakery suite. Excellent. Very good. Melvin Benitez, help me with number three. Um, the student did not Mm. Ask. Ask question. Okay, the students did not ask a lot. A lot of questions. Okay. A lot of questions. Thank you, Melvin. Ana Palma, help me with number four. Christian didn't didn't buy a, a new guitar. Christian didn't buy a new guitar. Okay, thank you. Ruth Rodriguez, number five. We didn't uh, wash on the the car the car <laughs> on, on Saturday. The car on Saturday. Exactly, you're right. Thank you. We didn't wash the car on Saturday. Number six, Gloria Avendaño. Okay, teacher. Fiona did, did not uh, visit uh, her grandma. Okay, Fiona did not visit her grandma. Brenda Calderon, number seven. We did, we did, uh, we did not uh, do an exam, uh, no, last week. All right, we did not do an exam, uh, exam last, week. last week. All right, thank you, Brenda. And Marlon, you help me with the last one, please. Okay, you didn't read the newspaper yesterday? Okay, thank you, Marlon. All right, so here I have another exercise. It's a fill in the blanks. So here we have the sentence, we have a blank and we have the verb. I want you to complete the sentences by using, first of all, the affirmative form and then you make the sentences negative, okay? 
So let's try. Um, Emma Orozco, please complete the first sentence. She bought, bought a new car. Exactly. Now make it negative, please. But, um, she didn't buy a new car. Okay, thank you, Emma. Let's see, Jose Hernandez, number two. They play tennis on Sunday. Mm -hmm. Negative? They, they not play tennis on Sunday. You didn't or did not? Didn't, didn't. Okay, okay, okay. Right, so you say they did not or they didn't play tennis on Sunday. Thank you, Jose. Fabricio Alexander, number three. Sue so, goes to the school. Make, uh, change it into the past, please. What's the past of goal? It's goals. When? That is when. 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 Okay. So, so went to school. So went to school. Now make it negative, please. So didn't go to school. Excellent. Thank you, Fabricio. Carlos Herrera, number four. I call him. I call he... him in the negative. I didn't call him. All right. Thank you, Carlos. Maria del Rosario, help me with the number five. He sold his house. Okay. And he didn't sell his house. Very good. Number six, let's see who hasn't participated. Catherine Rodriguez. Some drunk, some juice. juice. And the Some negative. didn't drink some juice. Okay, thank you. Let's see, Marlon Ernesto, number seven. We listened to the news on the radio. We listened to the news on the radio. And the negative is? Mm -hmm. We didn't listen to the news of the radio. Okay. Thank you, Marlon. And the last one, Jose Angel. Uh, Justin uh, and Brian Brian wrote, wrote a letter to their mom. Okay, now make it negative, please. Uh, Justin and Ray write a letter to their mom. Didn't write a letter to their mom. Okay, very well. So that will be all for today's class. Thanks for your attention. Just let me remind you about the access to the platform. It's important that you get into the platform, please. And it's very, very important that you start working. So please do your best and just complete the exercises in the platform. If you have any questions, just let me know through the chat. I'm there and remember we have a class tomorrow, okay? Okay, okay teacher. All right, see you, good night. 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 Good night.